Hi everybody, this is Boaz Fahn and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for February 26th, 2016. And the moon is in Libra today and it's trining Mercury, it's squaring Pluto, it's sextiling Saturn, it's opposing Uranus, so much aspects in the sky, so, so many aspects in the sky and so much energy in the sky. It's a great day for networking, it's a great day for getting involved with people, it's a great day for um, putting yourself out there but there's a few precautions you would have to take if you want this road to be successful first of all let's start with the more positive aspects the trying to mercury can bring a lot of great ideas and a lot of great conversations and a lot of flowing inf and, and really flowing information between people uh, in your surroundings and you the sextile to, to saturn can bring you that confidence bring you that efficiency that you need to get ahead and do things. It can bring a lot of work too. But the square to Pluto is all about drama. So be careful from that drama. Take things in proportions. Don't let drama erupt in your life and disturb what could be a great day. And that uh, uh, square to Pluto is already coming down at around 1300 hours Central European time, that's around 900 hours Eastern Standard Time in your morning America, so you won't be suffering too much from it. Let's talk about the opposition to Uranus. We can feel like everybody's trying to show off today and that we don't have any patience for it and everybody wants to show their unique side and who they are. So let people do whatever they need to do and have their little courtship dance and you remain with those more positive aspects and be social uh, and socialize and, and utilize this day for networking. At around uh, 1400 hours Central European time, that's around 1000 hours Eastern Standard Time, the moon becomes void of course and the energies really cool down. <coughs> I want to talk about two more, two more transits that are in the skies during these days. The sun is conjunct Neptune, a time for great fantasy and great imagination. Utilize, harness that uh, to really progress things here on Earth. Don't disattach. Don't, don't be disattached. I'm sorry. Don't disattach yourself from things that need to be done and need to be solved, but utilize this energy to help you be creative in how you're going to solve them. And Mercury in Aquarius is sextiling Uranus. And that's again talking about the ability to think outside the box, to gather new information and digest it into your life, to really understand new ideas and new concepts. So the more you get exposed to new information today, the better you can sift through the dirt and find those gold nuggets you need to take on your way. Thank you for listening and have a great weekend. Bye-bye.